This is a demonstration of the Vintage Ultra record player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. When you receive it, the first thing to do is screw down the two transit screws on the record deck located here and here. Screw those all the way down so the deck floats on its springs. Also remember to unclip the arm. The four main controls are on the front side panel and are marked for on, off, volume, treble and bass. On the deck you have the speed control here, stop start control here and 7, 10 or 12 inch size selection here. You can load between 1 and 6 records, I'll demonstrate with 2 just so you can see it play. Pop the records onto the spindle edge and put the stacker arm across. Select the correct speed and size and then flick the switch down to auto to start the auto changer. To skip to the next record, just flick the switch to auto again. So I'll just demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. the arm lifts off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually at a time, you can just pop an individual record down the spindle onto the platter and with the stacker bar in the upright position you can flip the switch to auto and the arm will go across automatically or you can select manual start so that the turntable turns and you can place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, carefully lower the stack arm down like so, so that it knows to switch off when it reaches the end of the record. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar left in the upright position, as pictured now, that triggers the repeat function and the same record plays over again until manually switched off. So I hope that covers everything for you, but if you do have any questions when you receive it, I'll include my personal email address in with the machine, and please use that method to contact.